Welcome, in front of me is a Vivo Y19S and today I will show you how you can enable and set up your portable hotspot. So to get started, you will want to swipe down from the top of your screen twice, which will show you a bunch of toggles, and we're looking for the hotspot toggle, which for me it is visible right over here. Once you see it, first time around you want to hold it, and this will quickly take you to the settings, where you will want to begin by selecting the hotspot password and most likely getting rid of it and changing it to something that is a little bit easier to remember. I like to select a very simple one, 1 through 8. It will need to have 8 characters in length, and from there you can click on OK and that's the password being changed. Now you can go over other options in here and customize them to fit your needs, but the way it's set by default, uh, this is basically what could be considered a compatibility mode. And if you don't know what these settings do, I recommend keeping them as they are. From here, we're gonna close this, find the toggle once again, and this time around, you simply tap on it to enable your hotspot. And from now on, you can connect to your hotspot with other devices. Also by default, hotspot will turn off after about 10 minutes of inactivity when it's not being used to preserve battery life. Uh, you can turn that off, but I actually recommend keeping it on as it does consume more of your phone's battery. So if you forget about it, the device will turn it off for you when you're not using it or when you're done using it. And you can also turn it off yourself by tapping on the toggle once again. Uh, one more thing to keep in mind here, which I didn't mention, when you enable your hotspot, keep in mind the Wi-Fi right now. If I enable hotspot, Wi-Fi turns off. It's using the same antennas to do uh, basically two, uh, these two things. So uh, why it can either do Wi-Fi through the antenna or hotspot. It can do both because there is not enough of them. So when you turn it off, it automatically will then switch back to Wi-Fi on. But anyway, with that being said, hopefully you found this very helpful, and if you did, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.